This is Force 13, are eh? you? Welcome to another update on the local weather scene and we start off with the BSCH uh, website. It's a GFS uh, model and uh, what we're looking at is the wind factor. The wind values, bottom left of the screen. BI Meteorology across Australia has a few warnings in place. And amongst these warnings, severe weather warning. For damaging winds, here's the latest uh, 12 hourly rainfall from the Bureau of Meteorology, and it's the area south of Perth, in the southwest corner of that state. Again, west coast Tasmania. Initial minor flood warning is in place for the Goulburn River. Minor flooding taking place, Goulburn uh, River upstream Lake Eldon. In the 24 hours of 5 pm yesterday, 40 millimetres of rain has been recorded in the Goulburn River catchment upstream and is now easing. The BIA's total forecast of rain, rainfall scale on the right hand side of the screen. And it's not like much uh, difference to the weather pattern that uh, the southern states have experienced, along with uh, the snowy mountains over this uh, winter period. Strong wind warning, Port Phillip Bay, West Coast, Central Coast, cancellation for the East Gippsland Coast. And a gale warning will be in place for Port Phillip, West Coast, Central Coast tomorrow. And this is a view of a live webcam at the, uh, I think it's the Brunswick Hantle Tree River. And now we have a gale warning for the central, south central coast, lower south east coast. Strong wind warning, far west coast, upper west coast, lower west coast, Spencer Gulf, Investigator Strait, upper south east coast, cancellation Gulf of St Vincent's down there in South Australia. And for Friday, a gale warning for the south central coast and the lower south east coast. Final flood warning has been issued, or I should say, uh, flood watch for northwest, north, central, southern catchments. And no further flood is expected in the northwest, north, and southern parts of the state. Now, this is a live streaming webcam at the mouth of the tree withers river, and it's I think located Point Danger. Gale warning for the southwest, central west coast, far northwest coast, upper east coast, lower east, southeast coast, 
Central Plano Lakes and Southwest Lakes sees the small craft of the gale warning. Minor flood warning for the North Esk River down there in Tasmania. Minor, uh, minor flooding may develop along the lower North Esk River about Coralin during a Wednesday evening. Strong and dangerous flows may be a hazard over the next couple of days. Severe weather warning, damaging winds, south west, lower west, south castle districts, damaging winds may continue to, during tonight in the wake of the cold front south west of Mount Jewett to Bremer Bay. Heavy rainfall over the warning area will ease from the west over the, the next few hours. Cold front has moved over the south west corner of the state and will continue to move east during the remainder of Thursday with the cold and showery. South westerly flow continuing in the wake of the front thunderstorm. Small hail possible over the southwest of the state until early Friday morning. Here's the area under the warning. Apology if there's any uh, mistakes in this update and. Uh, there's uh, quite a bit uh, going on. I'm on standby to go live on the main channel covering the Northern Hemisphere and the Tropical Sea. The Gale Warning, Lesser Sun, Port Perth and Leeuwin Coast, Strong Wind Warning, Port Perth, Local Waters, Millville Waters, Pilbara and other coasts. And finally, this is a view of the International Space Station a few minutes ago, flying uh, into our daylight to the southwest of or southern region of Australia. And as mentioned, I'm on standby to uh, go live on the uh, main channel covering Hector and the Hurricane, the Hawaiian Island region, and the Typhoon Shen Shen up in the Japanese region. There are a couple of other act lows that have come on the radar. And once again, an apology if there's any mistakes in this update. I have been extremely busy uh, producing uh, video content for the main channel. Nathan, the owner operator, Force 13, is currently down in the Caribbean Sea region having a two week break. And there's also activity in the East Pack, you know, just uh, to the rest of the Mexican coastline. And we will uh, continue to bring the latest information on the local weather scene. And if you'd like to be involved uh, as part of the Australian Ocean uh, operation, here's the outlets. details. You can visit the website 413.com with the latest. You can also find our YouTube page, search Force 13, all in text, subscribe if you haven't already. You can also find our Facebook page under the same name, and we're on Twitter, our handle at Force 13. If you'd like to follow us or send us a tweet, we'll respond. You can also uh, follow Force 13 on Skype at our account, and my personal account on Discord, Fool13 at extension 9094 for Tropical Weather Chat. And if you haven't linked to the AU channel, it would be appreciated.